Hi everyone, I'm Farhan Aminfar and as a member of the cardiology department of the Schuch in Lausanne, I have the pleasure to share with you our work on coronary bifurcation lesions, which is the POTPOF study. Here's a bifurcation, and as you all know, proximal optimization technique, called POT technique, consists of inflating a shorter but larger balloon adapted to the mother branch size. With the POTPOF study, we tried to take advantage of this largely used technique and to turn it into a diagnostic tool. This multicentric observational pilot study sought to validate a very simple angiographic sign called the Potpuff sign as a stentor position marker in the mother branch. To do so, we compared the Potpuff sign with the OCT, which is the actual gold standard for stentor position assessment. So basically, how to perform a Potpuff sign. Let me use this example to illustrate my words. We are in a bifurcation and this larger part is the mother branch. As you can see, the inflated balloon isn't large enough to be occlusive and that would be a positive Potpuff sign with the progression of the contrast medium through the inflated balloon. By increasing the diameter of the balloon, we assess greater position, the contrast medium can no longer progress through the balloon, and that would be a negative Potpuff sign. We analyzed 50 procedures with any non-left main bifurcation PCI. Potpuff sign was performed, followed by the OCT, and no complication was observed. The first result to be highlighted is the frequent malaposition in the mother branch with a prevalence of 26% according to the OCT and 24% according to the Butpuff sign. The second crucial point is that with a sensitivity of 69% and a specificity of 92%, the Popoff sign showed great performance predicting the center position in the mother branch. As you can see, positive and negative predictive value were respectively 75 and 89%. Even if these results support our initial hypothesis, we hope to reduce the confidence interval of our sensitivity and in order to reach values above 80%, a total of 187 procedures will be included in the near future. So now what's to remember? On the one hand, the frequent malaposition in the mother branch and on the other hand, the Potpuff sign. Simple, accurate and cost-free, which could be part of the answer to assess and reduce malaposition in the mother branch. That being said, it's important to keep in mind that these are preliminary data and that we hope to share soon with you the final results based on more procedures. Thank you very much for your attention.